Okay, I could not get my phone to transfer, it's an Android phone, to transfer my files via USB cord. There's one end and then the other end is a little bigger. That's the, a normal USB and this is a smaller end that goes, hooks into the my smartphone, my Android phone. It's a LG K8. Anyway, uh, so it would charge it would charge the phone from the computer, the laptop, to th the laptop through the USB cord here into my phone. It would charge, but it would not transfer the files. What I did and what worked was I turned my phone off. I took the battery out, and I took out this micro SD card, and I left it out, and then I boot put the battery back in. I even, actually, I even took the SIM card out of the phone too. I took the SIM card out, put it back in, and then I put the battery back in. I didn't put this micro US uh, micro uh, storage back in, um, whatever, and put the battery in. Booted it, booted the phone up, because it's a smartphone and it's like a, a computer. And uh, so, and it, and I hooked the USB port, USB line up, and to the computer, from the phone to the computer. And lo and behold, I actually got that pop-up to come up, which was the um, saying on well, my phone. I got the pop-up on my phone, which wasn't working before. And that's the whole problem was that pop-up wasn't, it, it says allow, something about allow this program or device. Um, I'll have it as a thumbnail, but um, it said I didn't have it allow or, or not allow. So you click allow. It automatically transfers the files from. It automatically transfers the files from the uh, smartphone to the computer. It's Windows, uh, just Windows 10, and these are pumpkin pumpkin plants, so they spread a lot. Uh, but anyway, um, so then you wait for the files to transfer over, and that's how I solve the issue of an Android phone unable transfer files from the phone to the computer now you could have a USB cord that is charge only some some of these cords are only charged so that could be a problem maybe try a different cord turn your phone off turn it back on take the take the battery out um, take the um, the sim card out take the micro if you have a storage a uh, micro SD card if you have that take it out and so that's that was my result. That's how I got the issue to result to be resolved. And action I can actually upload this video because it's made from my smartphone to YouTube and um, continue on my way. All right, that's been my my tips, my tricks of how I solved it. Have a great day.